Deep in the heart of the Philippines, on an island some say you shouldn't go, there is a river where for thousands of years this remarkable place remains secret, known only to the local inhabitants. Who believe that a magical enchantment lies upon this place, guarded by ethereal spirits and duende. We got up at 4am as we had a six hour drive in front of us. Starting in Governor Henaroso, driving to Hinatuan on the beautiful island of Mindanao. And on a long drive in the Philippines, you're always guaranteed to see some interesting sights. We've got a guy here on a motorbike with another guy pillion. And then they're just carrying a mattress as you do on a motorbike. We've got some more piggies on a motorbike. We've got a motorbike which thinks it's a truck. I think it's a charcoal now. Yeah. I think he could have got a bit more on if he'd have tried really hard. We've got one. There were ten of us set off on our adventure to the Enchanted River in our convoy of two cars. We stopped at Tagum City McDonald's and there's some interesting choices on the menu. You can have rice bowls for your breakfast. As we arrived at the Enchanted River, we were greeted by this massive head sculpture. Yeah, so Queenie. we're not on our own today. <laughs> Queenie's here, Princess and Dana. Hi. <laughs> and then I think they just uh, they just finished feeding the fish. You can still see them. Yeah, you can still see some of the fish in the river. And the shades of blue are amazing, it's really clear. And it's a little bit overcast today, so when the sun comes out, it actually lights up and uh, is a bright shining blue. But even so, it looks really amazing. The Enchanted River holds many supernatural wonders. Local legends speak of mystical creatures such as fairies, nymphs, duende, and ethereal supernatural beings who guard the river's sanctity and serenity. It's also said that you must treat this river with respect and never swim after dark as the guardians may drown you. This river is fed from a freshwater spring that comes from underground cave system that has not yet been fully explored and the actual source of the river is still unknown and this only adds to the mystery of the Enchanted River. And now it's time for a swim. It is clear water. Yeah. Sama? Mm. Very yeah. nice. Very guapo. Uh, very cold. Very cold. Very cold. <laughs> I think it's quite warm. It's you not should, very cold. You should try a river in the UK. <laughs> We've got one incoming. Got two incoming. <laughs> Come on. Look now, man. Look now. Look now. No. I said it's cold. <laughs> and now we had a slightly nervous moment when we found out whether the iPhone was really waterproof as it was claimed. The river flows down into the sea, which is a few hundred meters downstream, but the fishes are obviously used to the current. Water was slightly brackish, which means it was mixed with the sea salt water slightly. And I'm not sure what type of fish these are, 
but I thought their tiger stripes looked really cool. This was the view downstream in the part of the river that you can swim in. And there's some beautiful tropical trees overhanging the riverbanks. What's that down? And when the whistle blows, it's time to get out as they feed the fish. For me, I do think this place is magical. It certainly cast a spell upon us and we had an amazing day. I'm glad you could join us and if you've enjoyed the video, please check out some of the other videos on our channel. Take care, bye bye.